Hello guys, it's me Chelito Suave here again with another tour video. This time we're talking about Madison. Okay, this is the third facility that we acquired. It was a school originally, but they gave us a call letting us know that they're gonna shut down and asked us if we would like to take it over. And we did, we obliged. Now, some of the pros about this facility is it is by far the most beautiful campus we have. Uh, everyone that works here that has been to that campus has all agreed, yeah, that, that facility is really nice. If you are in the Citrus Heights and Rancho Cordova area, this is probably the best space for you. However, it might be hard if you're someone who has likes to have their child with a busy schedule. Uh, it might be hard to find a time that fits you. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull up the diagram right here. Once again, this white diamond shaped thing at the bottom there, that's our entrance point. That's where the video is gonna start. I didn't have a gimbal, so forgive me if it is shaky. I don't think it is shaky, but some of you might be pickier than me. So um, we're just gonna walk through the campus so you can see it and hopefully make your decision on whether or not you would like to take lessons with us here at New Songs. And if, it's worth, if you find it worth it, don't be afraid to drive to one of our other campuses because you feel like there's more of something that fits you. Uh, we have a lot of exceptional teachers here at New Songs. Just we're all at different campuses sometimes and if that fits you and you're willing to drive, it'll be worth it in the end. So let's take a look at Madison. All right, so here we are at the Citrus Heights campus, Madison Avenue. Um, you'll see it's not that big of a space, but it is our most beautiful space by far. So this is the entrance, uh, some cool art on the walls, an aquarium. And I believe the TV should be having some cameras being put on there just like uh, Laguna and the other campuses do. This is our teachers here at this campus. It's a limited selection because the space isn't that big, but nonetheless, they are great teachers. And then this is our front desk. She was uh, on the phone, so she couldn't wave at us. Now I'm gonna turn around and show you kind of the whole lobby and all. Really nice and relaxing, a nice couch to sit on. Now room one was busy all day with Paige. She is a piano teacher and I forgot to take a picture of the inside so we won't see the inside today. But if we look to the left, that would be our bathrooms. And then there's one more room over here off to the right that we're gonna walk in. And I'm gonna show you a picture of the inside with Jake and one of his students and a little clip of them uh, kind of in their lesson. As you see, uh, it could be a lot of fun teaching here. And there we go, there's our Norman Reedus lookalike on the piano. And uh, we're gonna turn the right corner here. Now this will open up into the big beautiful area that we're talking about. Uh, but first, this is kind of where our vocal lessons happen here at the campus, at least that's what I've seen so far. And obviously some piano. And then this is where the piano labs happens. Um, and progressions so it's nice little thing against the wall with a beautiful mural and then we're gonna look into the uh, actual progressions room and we're taking a right turn and the first thing we're gonna see on our left is the guitar room specifically for guitar tons of guitars in this place nice big room and next would be what I would consider the best drum room we have out of all of our campuses as you see, it's a very beautiful space. Could have been a recording studio. Uh, it's just nice and um, woody, homey. And last but not least, the grand finale, the grand piano on the stage with the beautiful Instagram-ish lights on the top. By far, probably my favorite spot in this uh, campus. We do have lessons that happen right there on the stage. Sometimes it could be a little bit hard to teach on the stage but because of the limited space, we utilize it anyways, and piano players love using a grand piano anyways. Um, but it could be distracting sometimes for younger ones because people will walk in and out of there, either making copies or whatnot. And over here is the water station, but I want to show you something really cool. This is like a opened up piano. You can kind of see what's going on in the inside. It's a really cool little random piece that we have. And then as we turn around and walk forward, we're back at the beginning where we entered. There's Gabriella about to walk across and there's the aquarium. And yeah, this is the lobby. This is Madison. 
And uh, yeah, so if you want to come to CE and take lessons at probably our most beautiful campus, once again, it's Madison Avenue in Citrus Heights. Uh, give us a call or visit our website. Uh, that'll be linked down in this description. And I guess welcome to new songs. <laughs>